Hey guys, welcome back to Breath of the Wild again. The again playthrough in preparation for Tears of the Kingdom, which is coming out very soon. It is time to do Divine Beast Varuda, which means we get to ride on the back of Sidon and do this really cool thing that's fun every time. We've got all the stuff we need. I'm ready. Here we go. Yeah, the world's a busy place, man. That's something we could talk about, but first, awesome music. Let's get that ice. What's that ice? We're getting close. See if we can do two and one. Should be pretty easy. Right, go. Oh, we gotta watch that stamina. That was close. Can we get rid of that ice? Sure thing. If the gyro would help me out. There we go. Oh sweet, he's going up the right side. Sometimes he takes you up a waterfall you've already done. Yeah, we got this no problem. Nothing to it. I remember the first time ever doing that, how cool it was. <laughs> All the divine beasts are very cool. Except for the Rudania one, where you have to whistle to Yanobo. That one's kind of not as fun. But all the other ones, though, have a really cool breaking down the beast thing to enter inside it. Well, Link, here we are. Looks like this is where the real work starts. Best of luck. Nice job cutting off the water flow from this divine beast. Show the enemy no fear. I'll see you back at Zora's domain. Farewell. I like that piano at the end of that song. Oh, we got a load. That's okay, though. We can leave this one in. 202 rupees. Not enough. Not nearly enough. Now time for the most soft-spoken person ever.
guidance stone there contains the information that you will need. All right, let's do it, lady. So soft and quiet, so gentle. That's why she's a healer, I guess. Man, we're just one-shotting everything in here. Ancient screw. Now she talks louder though, which is interesting. She's so soft-spoken every time except for like right here. Oh yeah, first we get the, the map. The Zora outfit is so cool looking. I like the one in Twilight Princess too. I just like water related stuff. Good. You've obtained the map of the Divine Beast. You will see several glowing points on your map which represent the terminals that control Ruta. Take Ruta back by activating all of the terminals. Be careful. All right, the easiest, one of the easiest Divine Beasts. I like the Divine Beast though. People talk crap about them because they're not official dungeons or whatever. But they're fun. I enjoyed replaying them just recently. And I'm sure I'm gonna enjoy them again right now. There are four music changes with each terminal it's kind of a neat effect all right so the next ones are all up here I'll never forget this right here the video capture got messed up my very first time ever recording this game Hand it to Elgato though, this HD capture card, whatever. The HD 60 has. I haven't had any issues with it. Knock on wood. And I put it under pretty heavy use. There are three terminals remaining. You can do it. You can do it. But yeah, the world's a busy place, man. You know what makes me think that? How every day there's news articles that are refreshed. Every day somebody's writing new articles, and that's just journalists. rupees right yeah I don't know man I'm I'm feeling very biased towards this game right now like I'm almost thinking just because that footage of tears of the kingdom wasn't the most exciting thing I just find it I feel like this is our ocarina of time and it's gonna be hard to beat notch it is but it's somewhere around here let's see did I guess correctly yes oh wait we could get this right now I gotta remember to check in with the lab and upgrade stasis and whatnot although I don't think oh speaking of there you go ancient core that's what we need for stasis. I still don't think we have three, though. I 
I'm like one and a half energy drinks in, and I'm starting to feel normal again. But still, same day as that I had that fever last night, which was crazy. There are two terminals remaining. You're nearly there. You're nearly there. Sorry, me for I don't mean to make fun of you. No, yeah, I just the world being busy. I bring that up because I feel very unbusy. I don't do anything anymore, man. It's crazy. And like people that have actual. Demanding jobs. Like first responders and stuff. They don't have a moment of free time. I have all the free time in the world because I don't do anything. But it makes you question your worth. Which is like why I was bringing up that whole thing about babies the other time. Like, you can't have a baby if you do nothing. I don't know. I'm just... forlorn, I guess. Ancient shaft! We need a bunch of those for the bombs. Like, I feel like I've done what I've needed to do on this channel when I was younger and more hyped up. And now, I'm fighting that burnout stuff. And I need to get back to traditional work and stuff. It's just, it's a weird limbo period I'm stuck in and it's... feels like the music of this dungeon right now, where you're just kind of like... You're here, but not really. But I'm easily impressed by people and how busy they are. Okay, we're good. I don't know how many notches I have to raise this thing. Just doing it one by one. Just one terminal remaining. I have faith in you. Thanks, lady. That makes one of us. I wonder if I could do this with only one stamina wheel. Uh, yeah. What's this now? Ten ice arrows, not bad. Alright, last one is in the elephant's head. Very curious what the dungeons and tears of the kingdom are gonna be like, especially since the powers seem all crafty and not functional. Like, I don't know.
You know what I just remembered randomly that uh, annoys me a little bit? Well, I'll tell you in a minute. You activated all the terminals. Now you can start the main control unit. There should be a new glowing mark on your map. Head there. Be careful not to let your guard down. Okay. Yeah, but the first time... I guess my ex-girlfriend now. The first time her dad saw me, he laughed. Because I'm short. This kind of stuff that just boils you up, you know? Anyway, water blight cannon. Imagine if I actually had a good weapon equipped, it would have gotten them down real fast. <laughs> now for the tricky part. use the knight's bow, I guess. If ever you're gonna use your best stuff, now would be the time. These guys and their HP have always been kind of, uh, a joke. I guess on master mode, there's the chance that you, they take longer, because they recover so fast. He's like one arrow away. My weapon doesn't even matter. There it is. Nothing to it, really. Although I, I don't think I could do going straight to Hyrule Castle and doing all the Blights and Ganon. I don't think I could do that. You know the little bulbous thing here? It kind of looks like that boss 
that eats my car in Wind Waker. Slightly. Not really, but kind of. Link, I'm so happy to see you again. Hello, Link. Because of your courage, my spirit is now free. And Ruta as well. Thank you. For I am now allowed by this freedom to be with you once again. Since I am now a spirit, my healing power would be wasted on me. I have no need of it. So therefore, I would like you to have it. Please accept Mipha's grace. <laughs> Yesterday, I was awash in a pool of tears. I had nearly given up hope and resigned myself to being trapped here as a spirit for the rest of eternity. But now you're here. All this time my hope was to see you once more. Promise me that you will not hesitate to call upon my power if you ever find yourself in need. Knowing that will let my spirit rest in peace. I must go. Ruta and I have our roles to fulfill. We are both honored to be able to play the role of support. We'll annihilate Ganon together. Farewell. Save her, Link. Save the princess. Save Princess Zelda. You need, like, uh, hearing aids in order to hear Mifa sometimes. Or is that just me? She's just so quiet. It's been a while since we've seen the elephant thing. I always like this, the music being all triumphant. It reminds me of the Megazord of Power Rangers forming. Just these mechanical beasts coming out of nothing. the divine beasts are going to be like in uh, Tears of the Kingdom, because they surely still have to be there, right? There's so many questions. Lost hope. If we seal him away, then we can restore peace to Hyrule. And both your duty and mine will be fulfilled. Father, are you well, I wonder? I want you to know I have always followed my heart. I'm sorry I made you worry. I 
wish I could see you again. Even just once more. Mepha's Grace. Yes, indeed. All right, so now... We have to check in. And we actually need to pick up the champion's weapon because there's a shrine quest associated with it. That's okay. I can always Pondo's Lodge for rupees and we can get that homeowner thing. I always like the Zora one because it seems like the most celebrated one. The other ones, you just kind of finish them and talk to the chief and that's it. Sorry, we did break some weapons so we can hold this. Now, where is the little girl that's singing the song about the ceremonial trident? I think she's down here. Oh wait, what time is it? Oh, it's... They could be asleep. This is not a bed. Well, yeah, it is, but... Well, never mind. We don't need to trigger it. We could just do it. Oh, wait a minute. Hi. Just who I was looking for. It'd be so cool to be part of a video game development team just once. I'm sure it sucks though at the same time, but just to have your name on a completed work of art and have it not be something stupid. going by again. Speaking of Breath of the Wild, we need to move somewhere far away from civilization. There's places they're getting fewer and farther between, or whatever the phrase is. In this crazy world. That's so busy, remember we started it? So there we go, we've gone full circle. <laughs> we've stayed on topic, I guess. Alright, now can we time this thing?
Yes, it worked. Took a little damage, but the shrine will heal it. Is this a diamond or something? It's either rupees or a diamond. I can't remember. But we shall see. Daga Keek. 100 rupees. Well, it's something. Better than nothing, I guess. Okay, so now what? I think we can end things off probably because next we have to make our way to the Tabantha region. Rivali's Gale is important, as well as Pondo's Lodge. So we'll have to go back towards the Great Plateau and head that way. But that'll be for next time, so thanks for watching and take care.